<laughs> so Amir, some of the guys know you, some don't. Just give us a little bit about you and, and anything that's on your mind. So I went to school at Wake. Uh, I was a sophomore. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm a left winger, and I'm really glad to be here. Thank you so much. Okay. <laughs> Gave me something else to read if you forgot. I really like to counter press. I love getting on the move. And uh, yeah. yeah, so my name is uh, Omir Fernandez. I'm from the Bronx originally, and that's where I've grown up in New York City. Uh, so I started playing for the academy when I was 14, and it actually was like a professional club, but at that youth level, I felt like it was a great place for me to develop, and it helped me a lot because it exposed me to so many places and so many things that I wasn't used to. I actually went to Wake Forest University where, you know, I spent a good time representing that great program. And School is important, but I felt like to achieve bigger things, I needed to take the opportunity now when it was present. Especially my mom was big on, hey, I think you should stay in school. And then my dad is like, hey, you know, Tyler Adams came here, Aaron Long is here, Sean Davis is here, and these guys are, you know, doing their thing here. He's gonna, he can get some playing time if he wants to. Oh, Mir, yes, just in and on the line, hey? Eh? In and on the line. Two touches. Look for the up back through, hey? Eh? Okay? Get him out of the way. Push. Punch. Tell me. Seriously. Come on. Here we go. Go get it, Amir. Yes. You know, in the college level, sometimes you have all the time in the world to, you know, do what you want. But here, nobody has respect for you. Everybody wants to go after you and tackle you. So you have to play quick. And for me, especially my first practice, I was, like, getting used to that high tempo and speed. If you can't fit in positionally to what we're doing, it's not gonna work. It's not, it just cannot work. It, that is called reality. That is called we get paid to do this. You are a pro, do your job. I'm not gonna lie, it's like, at, I've been telling a few people that I still don't realize that I'm actually here. When I'm alone, I'll realize, hey, I just practice my first my first professional job and stuff like that. You know, I'm, a, I'm with a group of guys that want you to succeed, not just for themselves, but for the whole team, and they want to see you succeed as well. So I've had a lot of fun. You know, it's hard work, but it's fun. My dad used to work from where works from four in the morning till maybe four in the afternoon, and they put themselves through this hardship and stuff like that because they want to see their kids succeed and achieve their dreams. And since I was maybe four or five, my dad has known that I've wanted to be a professional athlete. And when he realizes that, hey, I'm doing it, and I did it, you know, he, like, when I first told him, I remember I congratulated him and he started crying because, you know, it's not something that happens every single day and he knows it. And, you know, my mom, you know how his Hispanic moms are, they start telling everybody, you know, my son did this, my son is this, and she's really happy. And it makes me so much, so happy that, you know, me achieving my dream makes them happy and stuff like that. 2019, I hope to make my debut for the first team, and I hope to score some goals in the USL and maybe hopefully one in the MLS. But as a team, I want to, you know, win something, Supporter Shield, the MLS Cup, and just you know develop as a player and continue continue to grow.